Okay, act calm, act calm. If I don't act calm, look, I know something's up when I walk in there. Okay, easy. Control your breathing. Breathe normal. Breathe normal. That'll make you calm. Oh god, they can see me now. Okay, keep against the wall and try and walk straight past the front desk. Don't make eye contact, just walk. Walk! Hey, Mr. Freeman. Damn it! I had a bunch of messages for you, but we had a system crash about 20 minutes ago, and I'm still trying to find my file. What's so close? One of those days, I guess. They were having some problems down in the test chamber, too, but I think that's all straightened out. They told me to make sure you headed down there as soon as you got into your hazard suit. Really? Maybe I'm not fired. In that case, let me show you what a genius I am and look at your computer. Someone has hidden my glasses again. Uh, yeah. Let's see... Wait a minute. This is a Windows blue screen. And you're typing on it like you know what you're doing. You're not doing anything. Let me help you. Shut up. You're just looking busy. That's your whole job, isn't it? Looking busy. Look, you have to reboot it. Where's the reset button? Is this it? My god, hey, what are that. you doing? Well, that's not it. Come on, Gordon. You trying to get me into trouble? Okay, you can all go to hell if you're gonna act like that. See if I ever do anything nice for you again. Because I won't. As I expected. What was that? You trying to say something about me? Man, I'll kill you. Pricks. Boy, they've got some lip up in here, I'll say that much. Makes me wonder what else they're saying behind my back. Well, it doesn't matter. I could take on any of them. Freeman? What's up, fool? Man, someday I'm gonna own this place. Oh, there's management. Let me guess what they're talking about. You, sir, are mad! Dinosaurs are reptiles! They must be cold-blooded! Now you listen, and you listen good. Birds are one of the closest living relatives to dinosaurs we have. And I don't need to tell you that they're all warm-blooded. Do you know how difficult it is to maintain thermostasis for an animal so large? They're cold-blooded, I tell you. Let me tell you something. There's evidence to suggest that Velociraptors had feathers. Feathers! Now what does that tell you? Alright, this is stupid. I may as well go to work. I'm glad I'm not fired. That means I don't have to loot the place. Stealing from work is so much more stressful than not stealing from work. There's just no comparison. Move it, blue stuff. You got the wrong airlock, Mr. Freeman. You know I can't let you through here. Uh, I knew that. This is kind of awkward. Did I really go the wrong way? Yep, there it is. Sector B. And I am tripping this morning. Wait a second. Did I see what I think I did? Yep, I sure did. Newton's formula for gravitational force. Having trouble remembering that one, guys? What is this? Are we back in high school now? My department's working on quantum displacement. Just what the hell are you guys doing? Jerking around in lab coats from the looks of things. I just can't believe it. Those monkeys in there are having trouble learning about gravity. Whereas I can recite the quantum chromodynamic gauge invariant Lagrangian in my sleep. There is no justice. Am I hearing things? Turn down the music, you friggin' basshead! It sounds like a strip club in here! God damn! Just get some fancy girls in cages, why don't you? Good lord! Man, programmers, who knows what they're doing in there? They're gonna go deaf before the end of the year at that rate. Next time I have to go in there, I'll bring some ear protection. Ah, it's good to see you. What? Is he talking to me? He's not even looking this way. I could have sworn I heard something. Ugh, I'm losing my mind. Well, at least it sounded friendly, unlike that prick back at the lobby. This place is dead. Oh, I see a bowl of noodles with my name on it. Okay, I can do this. The guy on the left isn't looking, but the guy on the right is a rogue element. Uh, uh-oh, he's walking towards me. Stay cool, stay cool. Oh man, this guy's a pro. I can't compete with this. I shouldn't have hesitated. I had it. Oh well, guess I'll have to grab something else for breakfast. Like some oxycodone. I think it's time to go visit my locker. Get some happy pills and make the politics here just float away. Why do we all have to wear these ridiculous ties? Oh, you want to know why? I'll tell you why. It's symbolic. The management wants you to know that you're their dog. 
So you're wearing their leech. You don't see me wearing a tie, do you? You know why? Because I'm a rebel. The day they tried to enforce the dress code on me, I let them know there could be an accident around here if that happened. And by accident, I mean bomb the place. Hey, are you even listening? I forget you. My voice falls on deaf ears. I don't know why I even waste my time on you, sheep. I wonder if Feynman felt the same way. What the hell? Whose stuff is this? There's my name, but... But here's a bowling certificate? Baby pictures? Blue poncho? Where's all my stuff? Where's my stash? This is freaking me out. It's like everything's backwards. And I'm not even left-handed. Okay, I'm just gonna go to work and hope all these problems go away. Yeah. Oh, come on. Now somebody's taking my helmet. Ah, eh, screw it. I probably won't need it anyway. To the oh no, there's that Mark voice. Protective system for use in hazardous environment conditions. Shh. High impact reactive armor activated. Atmospheric contaminant sensors activated. Quiet. Vital sign monitoring activated. Automatic medical systems engaged. Wow, this suit does Defective not shut weapon. up. Selection system activated. Munition level monitoring activated. Communications interface. Okay, this online. thing's ridiculous. Where's the off button? There we go. Huh. Didn't it say munitions level monitoring? What does that mean? Does the left hand turn into a chain gun? I wish. Go well, right on through, sir. Looks like you're in the barrel today. Oh! Uh, did he just say I'm in the barrel today? Oh, shit. <laughs> Looks like I'm not the only person here who knows some dirty jokes. You're in the barrel. I can't believe he said that. I bet he says that to the other scientist and it goes right over their heads. He probably thinks I don't know what it means either, but I do.